What's up, everybody out there in reality in the world? This your boy Dub and One and Man with Small Ledge Repair, aka the GOAT. Yeah! And today, I want to show you a blessing that I received. And also, if you have the same type of snow blower, I'm going to show you what to check out for. Okay, this one right here. Basically, these cotter pins right here they can be replaced so people will throw a machine out like this because they think it's damaged and the scraper has some life on it so i can replace that i could just bend the frame back and i got the skids on there and the skids are adjustable so basically you can adjust it to the height where you don't damage your concrete and you can have it that high just put a few pennies underneath it or some washers to raise it up so you can clear the sidewalk with ease and it got Carlisle tires on it. So basically these tires are like $200 a piece. So basically this person was used to using the electric start. I'm going to take that off. All the gears is running on this. It lights up and everything at night. So basically I got a deal when I got this because a customer of mine a few years ago had it and then threw it out. And I just happened to ride past and I picked it up, put it on the trailer and brought it over here. And this baby is ready to go. So that's why I say, basically, you see the path that it clears. So it clears uh, 30 inches on the path. So basically, general, on any sidewalk, it'll basically just knock this out. And you see the chute control where it goes back and forth. Then it dries automatically itself. This one, you can take a hospital wheelchair and bolt it to the back of the frame and sit on the wheelchair, and this will pull you forward just off the base of the tires, and you don't have to use the snow chains because this is a powerful machine as well, and this is one of the top uh, machines. Briggs & Stratton makes the best uh, machines, but Tecumseh used to make the best uh, winning machines. But anyway, with the Briggs & Stratton, all you got to do is change your oil, make sure the oil is always filled up and everything, there's simple tips that I tell people, and always when you see stuff like that in the auger, like rope or hair, cut it out because that stuff would, uh, you know, basically it would just uh, slow it down. And all these are belt driven. So basically, I can take the front off of this and I can mount it to my snowblower. I mean, not my snowblower, I can mount it to uh, my ride mower and then have the belt drive system operate the auger. So, like I say, as a repairman and a mechanic, it's a lot of things that I do and I learn. And I always teach people the techniques and skills, and everything, what you got to do. So I'm kind of happy that uh, I kept that uh, hooked up. I ain't have to drive that this year. So basically, I'm just showing people what you can do off of your time and effort. Because all the time, instead of going to party and going to smoke and drink and hang out and see what your friends doing you can be putting your business in a better perspective to get more and this is the reason how you got to stay competitive out here in the field because every day is somebody just dying to get a better job in a position once you get them jobs in position you hold on to them because if you do not hold on to them somebody's going to take them opportunities from you and then the only person you can blame is yourself so this is why i say uh always take care of business first take care of your customers never downplay certain people because you feel this and that and i tell people show up on time and take care of your business and when you do that you will have rewards so that's why i say i got a free blessing that i can use and plus i can charge a cheaper price plus i got a backup unit so that's all of what it is about. So if that breaks down and my other snowblower breaks down, I have several other snowblowers and I still have a mini plow. Then I can go to the truck and put the plow on that. So all around, I covered every aspect of what I needed and I didn't have to depend on others to help me do it. I realized if I couldn't pay other people to help me do it, only thing I could do is set it up for myself. So when you set stuff up for yourself, it's like easy to have things get done and get accomplished. And like, I got I already got another pickup truck where I use just to haul scrap and trash and stuff like that. So that's why I say, 
you always got to have you something on deck and a backup for a backup. So by me having three trucks, that means I'm always going to be able to work all year around. So that's the importance of why you take care of your vehicles, you take care of your customers, you have a mind aspect because you got to pay for the cost of everything that you do. And like they say, another man trash is another man treasure. And it's like, I got this pickup right here for $500 the day my car broke down. And it was like I had the money right there to pay for it. So it was like, boom. But if I would have went party and all that stuff, I wouldn't have had an opportunity to get a truck for dirt cheap. Look at my nephew right there working for AT&T, my twin. That's why I say in this world out here, life is just great and it's a blessing. Then I want y'all to see my nephew because I thought about him the other day and I love him. This is my twin right here. Y'all see the younger version of me? This is my nephew. Hey, so, wood spall engine repairs, lawn care, snow removal. Y'all can contact me at any time for tips. And God bless y'all and thank you.